everybody, welcome back to Dirty Laundry on Clever Style. I'm Jocelyn Davis, and I don't know what that accent was. <laughs> I liked it. I'm Miriam Issa, and you guys, in honor of Selena Gomez releasing yet another super hot music video this week for you, we've got a little treat. Mm, we sure do. We are going to be taking a look at Selena's hottest music video look of all time. We've got to start with her new one, though, Same Old Love. I'm so sick of that same old love. She looks so gorgeous in this music video and really fun fact for you. I don't know if you noticed, this is a dress that Selena wore to the Rudderless premiere. I remember this. Gorgeous. She's actually wearing the exact same dress in her Ooh. new music video, but in black. When it's not broke, don't fix it. First up, let's talk about round and round oh back in the day, y'all. Selena Gomez and the scene. The trench coat look. It went with the character. She was playing like a spy person. <laughs> um, and I feel like every woman should always own a trench coat. Mm -hmm. A, it makes you look five years older. B, it makes you look wealthy. Mm -hmm. Oh, I good think point. so. I agree. She looks like she's dripping in dollar bills. I feel like there's money in this briefcase, actually. And if you can't afford lingerie with your boyfriend, then just wear a trench coat and nothing under. Surprise! <laughs> That's not what happened in the video, guys. Nope. But I still did love this look. So, so, so cute. And she was sort of looking a little more mature yeah. at this time. I loved yeah. it. All right, up next, one of my favorite videos. It has such a great message. Who says, who says you're not perfect? Who says, oh. who says you're not perfect? This is why I'm not a singer. But you guys, this is really when Selena was starting to transition into being a young woman and really empowering herself and her fans. And I remember when yep. I saw the look in this video, this gorgeous black gown, I just felt like she was growing up in front oh of her God. eyes. It almost made me want to cry. I mean, we grew up with her on Barney, you guys, <laughs> and then on the Disney Channel, and suddenly she is just holding her own in this gorgeous gown, mm -hmm. looking like the starlet that she would become. Mm -hmm. So many layers, so much hair, just a freaking queen. Yeah, I loved this look, and this is like the beginning of her big transition, and this just proves how important style can be in a music video, and I think she nailed it. Now, another oldie, but a goodie that we are actually obsessed with is Love You Like a Love Song. Love this video. I love this video. I, I love you like a love song, baby. Guys, just check this out. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if I love the dress or the hair more. Can we you can love all hair? of it. You can love all of it. Yes, let's talk about the hair. Oh my god, it's like a supermodel perm. It's just amazing. Mm -hmm. I, I don't know. To me, she looks like a 1970s, 80s disco yes. supermodel, like yes. Bianca Jagger. Let's yes. throw it way back, you Again, guys. the references in this brain. Inside of my brain, so many layers to this tiny onion. <laughs> um, it's like a disco karaoke queen. So true. So I love true. it. Yeah, big hair, big jewelry, uh, super sexy dress. I just, I love the look. Okay, now to totally change things up, y'all are about to scream as she channels her inner Marie, Marie Antoinette. Antoinette. You guys know who she is from Google like the it. 14th century and like, I think she had her head chopped off. But before she had her head chopped off, she kind of looked like this. Yes, and she was well known for wearing incredible clothes. Yes. I love the wig, I love the makeup. And she's like she's having so much fun. She's just like lounging on top of a piano singing. <laughs> she should have gotten an Oscar nom for this transformation right here. This is amazing. How good does she look? I don't even know if that's a blonde, white hair. It's white amazing. hair. She's going to look so good when she's old. Yes. When she's an old lady. She already <gasps> knows what she's going to look like. And that's so true. Gosh, a hot dye, old lady. I might dye my hair white after Let's this. Let's do it. I'll do it with you. Let's do it together. Yeah. Just kidding. <laughs> All right. Up next is a video that I think really serves as, yet again, a huge turning point for Selena's career, uh, and really as she was growing up, come and get it. You guys, the styling, the fashion, the costumes in this video were so important. It was almost like an additional character because we had never seen Selena make this emergence as a woman, and she was really embracing being sexy in a yeah. major way. There was something I love. very like Indian and Mediterranean, mm -hmm. Bollywood with the style. Uh, I mean, just look at this. And then the way that she was dancing with this outfit. If y'all ever want to do a little Bollywood dance in your living room, you have to wear something like this. You have to like watch this. this video. I can't stop. Like, I'm just thinking like, about the song in my head and I've been dancing the whole time. Now, these <laughs> looks, to be honest, are definitely costumey. The first yeah. black look that we saw in the video was maybe something you could wear out in public. This red look for the dance numbers 
was Ooh. a costume, but it was perfect for what she was doing. It felt like she was embodying something like Britney Spears would have done back yes. in the day. And I loved this. And on that note, we should definitely take a look at the video that she released after mm -hmm. Come and Get It. It only got hotter, you yes. guys. Uh, it's called Slow Down. Uh, so we see her hit the club in a crop top and pants, and like her ponytail game is on point here. But then later in the video, she takes it to the next level again when we see her in this like just strutting, strut, ooh, strut, ooh, like strut. the hair back in that like J Lo fancy mm -hmm. hat thing, and then the low cut blazer dress. It's so freaking hot. I love that you mentioned J Lo because you know how I feel about her. We, I feel all yep. of the feelings. I love her so much. <laughs> and this sort of harkens a J Lo vibe for me. And she is strutting down the streets of Paris like she owns the city. She does. And I love, I love that feeling, that vibe that she was putting out there. I love this look too. I love both of them. And there are several different looks in the video. She was in the backseat of a car. She had her hair in a high bun. Yes. She looked yes. incredible. When does she not look Oh new? my God. I think that was right about the time when her and Bieber had broken up. And I feel like you saw this video and was like, whoops. Whoops. My Just bad. made a big mistake. <laughs> All right, moving on. We've got to talk about Heart Wants What It Wants. Wants what it want. uh, 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 uh. This music video was so special, mm. so emotional. And again, the styling was so crucial to getting across this moment that she was having, the story that was being told. She wore an outfit. This is something she would wear. Yeah. It wasn't costumey. Felt like we were seeing her in the video. Exactly, she was for playing herself. herself. Exactly. It was probably the most Selena Gomez character we've ever seen mm -hmm. her do. It wasn't like hair and makeup and silly no. fun sunglasses or or a trench coat. It was just here she is as she is, Ugh. hair pulled back in a ponytail bun. It's like elegant but vulnerable. You can tell she's tortured. She's like beautiful but tortured. That's so poetic. She cried in the video. I felt like it was so authentic yeah. and the style didn't take away. Like if she'd been wearing something crazy would have taken away from the exactly. video. Exactly, good point, good point. Now, speaking of music videos, where she really just continues to strip herself down emotionally, she basically stripped herself down completely <laughs> in the video for Good For You. I just wanna look good for you. So first of all, she rocks this beautiful floral sexy dress, and she's not trying too hard. It's like her hair is just slightly mm -hmm. greasy, she's barely wearing makeup. It's all about her like vulnerability voice, yeah. and her voice. But then she removes the dress, and it's that classic scene when you know someone's grown up when they are just working a white t-shirt. When you know you can work a white t-shirt, mm. that is it. Your hair is not even done. You have hardly <laughs> any makeup and you still look this good. You are a star. Bravo, woman, bravo. It doesn't get more sexy or simple than that. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hit the comment section. Let us know which look is your favorite what you love most about her music videos and most about her style, because yeah. I know I've got a Pinterest page dedicated to it. I'm Jocelyn <laughs> Davis. Lying. This I'm is Miriam, Miriam Issa. Issa. <laughs> and we love you guys. We'll see you soon. Bye, guys. Before you go, though, click to the left to see a bunch of hot dudes rocking killer swimsuits. Ooh la la. Or click to the right for the best and the worst dressed at the Emmy Awards. Ooh, exciting. Ooh.